welcome back. Sorry that last episode took back practically 30 minutes, but I wanted to get the prologue out. Last the last episode we saw her get freaking ghosts and spirits and stuff. I hate that stupid bell. I love that bell. I wish I wish I had a bell next to my house like play it every morning. Where am I? Back home? Was that all a dream? Man, I slid right into my boots, literally. I see you're awake. A dreams. Some dwarven stranger and I rescued you from that hole. Oh, they are dwarves! Oh, good morning, Papa. Listen, I'm really sorry about that. I, uh, I'm not interested in your excuses, child. You could have been hurt or even killed, you know. I am rapidly losing my patience with your reckless behavior. I know, but I really... I was really careful this time. It's not my fault that a trap door put under my feet. The treasure we're looking for is really important, so an important treasure that was reason enough to put yourself in such a danger again. Would you have your mother? What would your mother do if we lost you? Have you ever thought about that? Where is this mother? It's very interesting. Most of start with a, with a mother, but now I'm starting the father. That's an interesting approach. How do I? How? What, what would I do, your brother? What? What would I do, your brother? Your friend, all of this nonsense just some damn tricking that you didn't even manage to locate. On the evening of your archery content, you should have been resting last night and practicing today. I intended to take on your first hunt after the competition as a reward for all your hard work recently. Well, you can forget about that. I have half a mind to borrow you from the competition as well. Papa, no, come on. I've been looking for this for and since forever. You should have thought of that before dragging in Jack to serve you in that dead. I had to pull out to pull you out of a hole. That was an accident. I know it was an accident. It's always a damn accident with you. Hey, I'm sorry I fell in the stupid hole that I, but I'm not sorry for not wanting to be trapped in a auditorium. I don't want to spend the rest of my life picking apples and feeding the chickens. Goddess, you just sound like your mother. And look what I, and I look what I did. I put her here. What was that? Nothing dear. God, that man's impossible. All right, all right, calm down, Lita. He's a jerk, but that's not like he doesn't have a point. I have gotten into trouble a lot lately. You should go find Papa and apologize. Oh, three left in the chest. Save game. Always oh, save game. I love that option. That gives you the same option. Twenty-five coins. Get up. The elves were the first. The elves were the first of the goddess children. They said that they have helped see. It. Arabelle lifted into the sky and blessed with magic. Long, long lives for their service. The elves lived in peace, prosperity, and their kingdoms spanned all over the island of Earth. One day, vampires appeared in the spawn of the fallen de dead gods. Elves are the masters of light, light, light magic, while the vampire masters of the shadows. They challenged the elves, hoping to. To capture and destroy the sacred sunstone, the source of Earth's power. The had lived in peace so long that they were unprepared to fight, and the vampires defeated them to protect the sunstone. They sealed the way into the darkness, then, changed them. then they just changed themselves to stone, hoping that one day someone would break the stone curse and revive them so they would turn, turn might, un unseal the sunstone. Oh, so we're gonna unseal the sunstone, kill the vampires, and do other junk. Treasure, 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 gotta find that treasure. Gotta find that treasure, gotta find that treasure, gotta find that treasure. Gotta find that treasure. Gotta find that treasure. Oh, wait, what's this? Nothing. My brother has green hair. Jeez, what happened? I think there are. Man, that's loud, actually. I'm looking at that. Let me drop that down. Actually, I'm not sure how that goes. Uh, there we go. There we go. I think there's some potions in the chest around here somewhere. And I'll take an apple for breakfast. Chest, 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 chest. Potion. Five potion ones. Ooh, I like this. Okay, I'm talking a little loud. I haven't really had time to practice the audio and whatever. Apple. A basket of it. Would you like to take one? Yay. Some items have special effects that you wouldn't expect. For example, apples will increase your maximum 
backfire. Oh, sweet, it didn't beat him. Get apple pointed or something. Uh uh. No! Can I have a slice of cheese? Oh, damn. Okay, my mother wants to talk to me. In the morning, Mom, where did Papa say he was going? He didn't, but I imagine he went out to my plane to help up set up for the archery contest. He looked pretty angry. Did I hear him complain about me up there? Well, he said I sounded like you if you wanted to call that complaint. Well, something was... It was something of an adventure when I was your age, you know? That was when your father and I first met. He didn't care for it then, and he doesn't want to see you go down the same path. And seeing how small you are, he's probably a little overprotective. I'm not that small. I'm 16. I can. Oh, sorry, I turned to 16 years old now. I can take care of myself. I know you can, not sweetheart, but there's some tell the difference between bravery and foolishness. What I do, I'm pretty sure I did bravery. You have to admit, it was it's a line you cross sometimes. Sorry. I guess that's true. I'll try to be more careful anyway. I'll remember to go find Papa so I can apologize. Actually, you might want to speak with the boy first. You know, that cute blonde one you have a crush on. What's his name again? Excuse me, I don't have a crush on anybody. Adrian, that was your father was a little, uh, brusque with him this morning. He all but forbade him from seeing you again. I don't think Adrian is a bad person, though your father will calm down eventually. Did you talk to Adrian? I believe he's at the temple on the northeast side of town. Yeah, that's a good idea. Maybe I will. Good, now, one last thing before you go, Lita. I want you to be home before dark. Vampires have been attacking people more often than usual lately. I mean, this time, young people and I don't... Young lady. It's, I mean, this time, young lady, I don't mind your adventuring like your father, but I don't want you to do it when the sun's overhead. But I want you to do it when the sun's overhead, understand? Yes, my mom will promise. Good. I love you, sweetheart. Good luck, you know. Man, this is a long dialogue. Long, long, long. Jeez! Okay, let's uh, let's get some items. Let's get the apple. Eat apple. Let's talk to my brother. Hey sis, what did Pop say? Something something. Yeah, I passed on last night. Oh yeah, did it, whatever. My cat. Good morning, Percy. I don't have any food for you. I'm sorry, Percy. Come on. Hey, like, shake that damn apple! What's this? Hello, I'm Tom Chowder, merchant, and I see a quarter of a You wanna say something? Right, right! You find one of the big crystal hiding around here. So, you should find one of the big crystal hiding around here. They have a secret. This one is in the Grey Brothers. There's one in the Grey Brothers just across the bridge in the south. Anyway, do you need anything? Uh. So he's a merchant. So. Wow, this is amazing. Smoke effect? No way. The particles are amazing. Oh wow. Let's go to Northeast though. I'm gonna try to stick close to the story and like grind behind the scenes. Oh, lovers. The end. Is the A character have a hitbox? Wow, that's amazing. Oh, Lita, I'm glad I caught you. I forgot about this. Yes, mother? The cat just ran away. I was hoping you saw him. Percy, that idiot cat, where did he go? Well, he ran past me and down the southeast. It was like he was possessed. How strange. Anyway, please look for him before we go out of town. Okay, let's just get a new cat. Lita. Okay, I'll go look for him. Okay, you haven't gone my far. Stupid cat. Well, Adrian will help me find him. Uh, let's go to the temple. Okay. Chest. Stardust curved crystals. The temple. And there is Adrian. I think that's Adrian. I'm not even sure. That is Adrian. He has long hair. He's 
today. Mom told me Papa said blah blah blah, man. Yeah, I'm used to it. Sorry, he's such a bad temper. Don't worry about it. Same to bring the word blah, blah, blah. Actually, about that. Oh, actually? Actually what? Maybe here. Maybe I show the golden ring with a little blue crystal on her finger. But the goddess could have really been the ring. If you're wearing it, where did you find it? It was a long twisted curve, whatever, blah. No kidding. Well, I gotta get credit. This game has a lot of freaking dialogue. That's a pretty good idea. My contact said you not to. My contact said not to wear. So just to make sure, take it off before we meet him. Okay. My camera ran away. Just ask me to look for him. If you want to pay me back for finding this ring, you can help me. I could do that. I heard about people that's acting strange in this pain lately. I wonder if it's just a coincidence. Last I checked, my contact didn't show up at the place yet. We got some time to look for your cat. Oh, by the way, Lita. Really glad you're still friends after all this. Me too. Oh, so you guys joined the party? Damn, I'm just, just spacing in the middle. Adrian has an adorable melee fighter with access to a shield, his power strategy clone. And bash shield with scale tag and hit with mark and reflection obtained later. Mark and reflection obtained later. Scale was only <laughs> level up. Awesome. Adrian's level. Okay, let's. It's... I'm gonna increase my magic for every character. Oh sweet. And... Yes. Julio, let's go. Let me crawl. Sorry, I love that crawling effect. Okay. Uh... Yeah, we haven't seen it before. That's the damn damn thing we saw earlier. And people here have the worst of memory. Yeah, look at that! I've never seen it before. What's that? I saw something shiny? No. My god. Hey, yeah, so, so why'd you put that thing on your finger anyway? It could have been crystal, you know. Because it was pretty. Wait, man. If your finger falls off, don't come crying to me. Don't worry. It started to glow a little since it's been in the sunlight, though. Lita had the power. Activate the power of the strange ring. In the light, the little blue gem seemed to shimmer like the water. I'm being nosed to her. Lita has gained the ability to cast Elven Focus, which grants her an increase of power during combat. Cool. Okay, time to go south seek now. Ugh. Isn't it this way? No, oh, we gotta go more south than means? Oh, let's go in here. Wow, what is this? This is Mr. Anger's house. Mom said, pretty friend, this way. I wonder if he was in this place. Maybe, maybe. Looks like Mr. Anger is here. Oh, so look around. Sweet. First chest. You found bombs. You need to explode cracks in the walls. Awesome. Did you hear something else coming from below us? on my armor or whatever. Ah, I better wear this something tells me I'm gonna need it. Don't forget to cut the gear to as you obtain it. Okay, let's do that. Oh, so we can put something on offhand? Oh, there's nothing though. And how do I... Whatever. I wonder if I can use bombs. Clear! And this game is really, really weird. Oh man, my mic. Let me see. Ah, oh, it's too small. Maybe I could crawl again. They really want to use the crawling mechanic as much as you can. Can I? Um... Come on. Oh. Strange. This place doing underneath his house. 
Abyss, I know. If I know, Mr. Anger has been acting funny lately. Anyway, looks dangerous. Watch out for those snakes. Say game. I love this game. No, that's not that bad actually. Oh sweet. Since I battle. Battle. No. Oh, let's see. I guess. So battle. Oh, there's an Adrian, so attack. Yeah. And yeah, scout. Okay. Oh, right in the eye. Does he have a poison? Come on. Yeah. Life potion. There we go. Between eyes. Okay, uh, skill. It's final. I should have done that earlier. Scout. 80. Okay, he has 10 magic too. Uh, the, can I do another skill base? There we go. Oh crap, I should've healed. Oh, I'm dead! Everything ends here, guys. Everything ends here. Come on. So not. Kill. Power strike. Yeah! Can I. Well, guys, I'll end it here. After a hard battle, I'm gonna get in the water because so the snake doesn't attack me. So I'll see you guys next episode and see what that these guys and everything's happening here. Okay, bye bye.